Hello everyone and welcome back to our road to Indian Glory career mode guys in Cricket Captain 2021 returning yet again we are today we are taking on Rajasthan Cricket Club playing once again as Bihar in this one day trophy match our one day trophy campaign has been pretty poor thus far it has to be said but we are definitely trying to build something into the future so i guess we do have to take our fair share of losses before we can do that so indeed we have made a couple of changes once again yadav has returned to the lineup in place of sabir khan purely because at this point in time his second limb form is actually done pretty good 17 and i will just go scroll through all the others around in the second limb and stuff who are doing well as you can see ranjan is going to make his way into the lineup despite being our only other keeper because look at that 550s on the trot it doesn't get much more form in that that's pretty good stuff without scoring 100 of course but very consistent stuff from ranjan and i think it's finally time for him to make his way into the lineup russell hasn't done enough really in this first team so i think for now he's gonna go and take a rest for his fitness just in case our fitness levels drop but sabir khan will rest and Yadav will make his way into the lineup. He has done very well, Sabir Khan, this season. So it is either one of them. But I think we're going to try and make sure that we blood Yadav as much as possible moving forwards. Because he is one of our strike star youngsters moving forward. So I definitely want to give him game time where possible. And also, actually, sorry, one more change. Sachin Singh makes his way into the lineup because he scores 130 and 77. We are going to try him in the middle order in place of Rasul. And with that, we are going to get straight into it. We're going to have to bowl exceptionally well today if we're going to come away with a win. Nonetheless, we're up against Rajasthan. Let's see how we go. Okay, they've got Nagakoti, of course, who plays for us at Kolkata. Let's call heads. And we have won the toss, Rijnish, and we are probably... You know what? We'll chase it down. We're going to bowl first. Data is going to open the bowling for us today, up against Singh. That is whipped away. First ball through the square leg region for four. Yadav returns to the attack, or to the lineup, and Garwell is dropped. Unbelievable. Oh, my goodness me. Yadav could nearly have, a, nearly have another wicket. He has not had many. That's for sure in his career start. That's a great start. Again, how about this time? Oh, no, he's dropped it now. Oh, my goodness me. Two drops against him, and he's dabbed that away for four. Will he make us pay is a real question. Loves a cut, doesn't he? That's four more. That's off the back foot now through point for four more. It looks like you only need a point for that player. Data to sing. Oh, whipped away. That's four. That's a good shot. Yard up again. Could have had two wickets. And he has finally got him. Garhual has to depart. Would you believe that? He gets dropped twice and he's gone for 21. Yada finally picks him up. Reduces his average to 40. Data into his fifth. Ooh, that's a great shot from Singh down the ground for four. And Yadav rounds out the power play. And with that, we are going to bring in Ashutushaman, one of our best players, of course. Especially with the ball. He hasn't done well in recent times, but he has an exceptional good average. And he's a good quality player. We're going to need him to come through for us today. That is a good shot, though. That has to be said. That's for Quadri very early into the piece. He bowled well in the last game, actually. Taking a couple of wickets, at least. Oh my lord, how that mist has honestly bemused me. Oh, that's a good shot through mid-wicket. That's four. That's good stuff. Rajasthan, 61 for one. Oh, good shot down the ground, though. That's four. Come on, what can he do now? Love him to take a wicket here. Again, swept away for four. These two getting into the groove now. He might have to really bring a bowling change in because the partnership needs to be broken. And it has been broken by Quadri. Singh just got completely deceived by that one. Lomroar to the batting crease now. Aman to Bahutuli. Or Bahutul. Oh, he's gone. He's behind. That's two wickets and two overs. Salman Khan to the batting crease now. The spinners wrecking havoc. 84 for three. Can we continue to rip through the order though? That is a great shot for six. What a shot from Khan. These two are bowling pretty good at the moment. Can we just keep another couple of wickets? That should be given. And it is. He's got to go. Oh, just clipping leg. 
Quadri gets another wicket. Arjit Gupta to the crease now. Quadri and Aman bowling very well together. Ashutosh Aman. Really good stuff. They're really having to battle in this middle period of the game here. Completely all over them. Although that is a good shot there from Gupta for four. Quadri has two overs left. 120 for four. Quadri to Gupta. Can we get one more is the real question before their spells are up. This is Aman's last. One for 29. Another one would be great. On raw, that's a great shot though, that's four. And he ends his spell. Quadri for his last now, 131 for four, and he's gone! Long raw, wow! Quadri has a third, just about struck in line. Gone for 25, another start, another wicket. That brings Kamlish Nagakoti from Kolkata to the crease. Martin to Gupta. That's a good shot, pass point for four. Anderson to Gupta again. That is a six over mid wicket, that's a great shot. I'm gonna call him for now. That's whipped away for four. 161 for five. He is driving this innings, Gupta, at the moment. It moves to 48. Corey Anderson to Nagakoti. Bowls him and oh my, that's a poor shot. It really has to be said. That's an awful shot. Nagakoti. Not really uh impressing me with the bat. And that is his 50. He's played very, very well. Martin is bowling very well at the moment. And we're going to bring back Yadav. They've got Sharma in very, very late in the piece. The death has arrived. Six singles are what we want. That is a boundary, though. Through the leg side. See how Anderson goes around the wicket. Just to change that angle up. Oh, this should be an easy run out. Oh, he's turned around. He's run Gupta out. That is brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. He could have easily ran out the non-striker, but he went to the other end, to Gupta's end, because he knew he was the in batter. He knew he had to get him out. He was already on 57, and that is a piece of fielding brilliance from Anderson. That is going to be a four, though. That's a great shot. And that enables us to actually start taking control of this innings, I would say. Or at least the back end of this innings. I wouldn't say the whole innings. But 197 for seven has a lot for the bowlers to do. It's an edge for one. Going back to Data now at the death. To Singh now. Oh, shot past the behind point for four. It's only six off the over. Gone, though. Singh's gone for 14. Oh, that's Rahul Chaha. Can't believe that. And Khalil Ahmed. Okay, we've got ourselves a, a, a challenge, at least with the ball, but he's on a hat trick. Yadav, can he get it against Khalil Ahmed? Oh, it's a play and a miss. You wouldn't believe it. Wow, well, bold though. That's four though against Data. Khalil Ahmed. Oh, off the back foot for four. Can Yadav get a four for? Yes, he can. What a bowling display from Yadav. What a change that was to bring back Yadav. He takes four for 35, his career best figures by a mile, and reduces his average from, I think, 55 to 24. Four for 35, fantastic stuff. Cleaned up the tail nicely and got Garwell as well at the top. 222 all out, 223 to win. I would actually say Bihar have a chance in this match at this point. That is not to say that it is going to be easy. Because they're gonna they're gonna have Nagakoti, Khalil Ahmed, and Rahul Chaha, who all play IPL cricket. So it's not going to be easy. Khalil Ahmed to Rijanish. That's a great shot through the leg side for four. Nagakoti to Ranjan. Great shot over point. That's all the way for six. What a shot that is. Ranjan, can he make an impression on his with his first game this season? Well, that's a great shot through the covers for four. 31 without loss after the first eight. Great shot from Rijnish, Captain Rijnish through the leg side for four. Last over before the power play is up and 44 without loss. We will be taking that. Rahul Chaha though, here the battle begins. Rahul Chaha in the middle. Oh my, Ranj Ranjan, what a shot over point for six. You would not believe that. Wow, that's a good shot. Khalil Ahmed will continue. But Ranjan just flicks it away off his hip for four. 57-59 without loss. A very good opening stand here. And to be fair, we're just going to have to continue to try and take the momentum away from Rajasthan. 68 without loss. I think our largest opening stand this season by quite a distance, I would say. That's a great shot from Ranjan for four as well. Moves to 45. Wow. 73 without loss. Cut away. That's four. Moves to 49. Can he bring up a 50? His first this season would be six on the trot, and you betcha. That's five second limb 50s, and now a Bihar 50. 
in the one day competition and the one day trophy four more 57 of 63 you have to believe he is in top notch form that is six back-to-back -back 50s for Vikash Ranjan wow in Insane. That's very impressive. And Richardish hasn't really even got going yet, to be fair. 85 without loss. Oh, that's a great shot. Pass the fielder behind point for four as well. Richardish against Chaha though, and he's bowled him. Yeah, it was coming. He's a good player, Rahul Chaha. And he has got the big wicket of Richardish, which leaves Kaiba Lamba, the youngster at the crease early. The 19-year-old at number three. Ranjan has the responsibility, but that is a great shot through the league side for four. 100 out for the loss of one wicket. Great shot through the offside as well. That's for four runs. Playing brilliantly at the moment. Can he continue? It's the real question. Oh, through the league side for four more. 110 for one. The DLS par is 69. We are well and truly on top, and we intend to keep it that way. Lambert's really got himself four off 19. He's, he's very slow to start, but he's got himself a platform. He can build on it now. He's seen a few balls. That's four, though, off the back foot. Khalil to Lamba. That's pulled away in the air. It's an edge. It's going to go the whole way, though. For six. Wow. He's 14 off 24 all of a sudden. Okay, Chaha. For his last few, he's got three to go. Ranjan. Off the back foot. Pass deep cover for four. He is playing brilliantly. 81 off 89. 93 needed at four and over. Playing a miss. Got a slip in place for him. For Lambert, that is. Down the ground. Over mid on. That's a great shot for four from Lambert. 141 for one. Can he play out? Chaha, you betcha. Just dabs that away nicely. And that interesting dive in vain for four. 78 needed at 3.7. The win is well and truly in our grasp at the moment. But can we finish the job is the question now. Grand Giant has to do this. Lamba through the leg side though for four. That's 150 for the loss of one wicket. 3.7 needed, but we don't want to take it too close. We want to keep the momentum going our way. That's an edge from Lamba for one. Moves to 88. Chandra Paul Singh into the attack now. Ranjan on 88. Probably getting a bit nervous. That's a great shot down the ground though. On 94. One big shot away. Lamroor to Lamba. Oh, he's been dropped. How big a chance will that be? First chance in forever, and they've dropped it. And Lambert's going to sweep that away for four to rub the salt into the wound. 166 for one, and sweeps it away now for four more. Ranjan on 94. Lomroar. Oh, it's an edge as well. A nervy edge, but it's going to be a single. He moves to 95. Sing to Ranjan. That's four. It's a misfield. Moves him to 99. Can he bring up a one-day 100? You betcha. He has played a dream knock today. Well played, Ranjan. Fastest 100 as well against Rajasthan. 113 balls. What a century it has been to back up five back-to-back -back second 11 one-day 50s. He brings up his maiden one-day 100. Wow. I mean, that is just amazing. What an innings it's been from Ranjan. He can really unleash now and give our side a chance to really squash R Rajasthan and leave them in ninth place instead of us. Lamba hits that down the ground for four as well. He's been a great support fiddle to Ranjan. Oh my goodness, that's a gift. He's on 100. You can't do that. Lomroar, again. Oh no, what have you done? Two full tosses in a row, two fours. New all-time record, highest innings for Bihar versus Rajasthan, 109. New all-time record partnership, Ranjan and Lamba, 104 versus Rajasthan as well. Bihar records being set left, right, and center at the moment. 30 to win with so many overs to spare. And that's going to be 50 for Lamba. His third 50 this season, very impressive from the 19-year-old. And it's the fastest against Rajasthan for Bihar as well. Off 55 balls. Well done. His average is now 40 with three 50s in seven innings. Fantastic stuff from Lamba. I just, I want to see him unleash, but at the same time, I don't want him to get out. I'm just going to leave it. Let's just play good strokes of cricket and let's get the job done. Ranjan. Oh, no. He's going to run out Lamba. That's not the way he wants to go. He's gone for 52 or 59. A great knock and a great partnership has to be said. And we're going to bring in Sarah Martin because he will definitely not muck around. Sing to Ranjan. 19 to win. But he's bowled. 
Oh no, he can't get the knot out, but he walks off 115 of 127. Well played, that's for sure. Corey Anderson now with Sarek Martin trying to get the last 19 runs as quickly as possible, to be honest, for the net run rate. That is the goal, but it's not going at the moment. Anderson again off the back foot though. That's going to be point for four. 11 to win, one to win now. This should be the win for Bihar. We've kind of prolonged it a lot further than I wanted, would have wanted to, but in the end, we have walked away with the win. Unbelievable. I'm very happy with that, guys. 115 off 127 for Ranjan and 52 off 59 for Lamba. And Bihar stroll home with seven overs to go. 223 for three. A very comprehensive display has to be said against Rajasthan. Very, very happy with that. Yadav, unlucky not to get the play of the match because he did get four for 35 and really helped us bowl Rajasthan out. But Ranjan, his innings of 115 has to be credited, that's for sure. His top score of, in, of his entire career. And, I mean, look at that batting form. That is consistent as it gets. Last six innings, all 50 plus, including 100. Would you believe it? Manindra Singh comes in as a batter, bowls one over, and gets Ranjan. That's his best figures ever. It's only his second professional wicket. Nakankoti couldn't get a wicket for Rajasthan. None for 30 and seven overs. Anderson was a little bit expensive, but what a throw that was to get gut the route. That was a big moment in the match as well. That was a brilliant masterclass in the middle of the innings. 20 overs between them for four wickets and about maybe 80 80 odd runs put pressure on them so that when they had to go for it at the end Yadav could come in and do the damage so it was very good stuff there with the with the ball and we walk away with a seven wicket win which now puts us in seventh place and our net run rate very much restored while destroying Rajasthan's net run rate and destroying their hopes in this competition all right and we are next up against services who are in sixth place at Palam. I'm very relieved, guys. It has to be said. We were on a massive losing streak. Looking at the top runs, we can see that Thapa has 595 at an average of 85. Kishan, 592, an average of 118.4. I mean, that, whew, that's an average. That is an average. Look at that. Oh, my Lord. 108, 161, 93 not out, 130 not out, 73. Bista, 488. Guy Quad, 471. And Kajuria, 461. Good to see Natish Rana scoring some runs as well. A lot of them too. Guna Sacra, 21 at an average of 13. Markadir, 19 at 20. Gopal, 18 at 18. Pratap Singh, 18 at 19. And Perel, 17 at 20. Looking down at Venkatesh Iyer, we can see he's on 367 at an average of 61. He did get 59 in his last match as well. And wow, look at his one day career. 50 with the bat. But guys, that is actually going to be it for today's episode, guys. I hope you did enjoy. We finally got a win on the board. I'm very, very happy with that. Beating Rajasthan at their home ground, which I'm very happy about, guys. But if you did enjoy, please make sure you leave a like. Subscribe for more content such as this. Join my Discord server. Hit the post notification bell. And I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye for now.